this video, my eyebrows make a long overdue appearance. Hey guys, today I am a cat. Anyways, today I'm doing a eBay find slash haul video. I recently discovered that you can buy things on eBay for like a dollar and they just take like three months to get here. So I bought like really a lot of useless junk that I didn't need, but I'm obsessed with it all. So I'm gonna show you that. I also have some stuff from Romley. Um, and yeah, so let's just jump into the eBay finds. The first thing I got, number one, is for fashion reasons, but number two I got it because I always wear these when I'm cleaning my house, and I just bought a house, so I'm gonna be living in that house, and I'm gonna have to clean it myself. It's this, just a face mask that kind of keeps the stink of my groceries away from my face. It's also very cute. So yes, um, I don't know all the prices of these items, but I do know that they were all under like a dollar or under two dollars, so I'll put all the links in the description. The next things that I got obsessed with are sunglasses. The first pair I got are these, which I personally do not think suit me very well. I don't know. I just don't think that they look very good at me. Also, they're supposed to be rose gold, but I think that the this part is rose gold, but the frames are a little more on the like, gold side, so I'm not a big fan. Also, I got these, which I've been wearing to work every day on the drive there. These are just some like basic, they're supposed to look like Ray-Bans, um, the Clubmaster style, but they're not like re 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 but they're not like replicas, they're just um, like they look like them, like it doesn't say Ray-Ban or nothing. And I believe that these were like two dollars each and they took like, this came real fast, this took a really long time. But I love them! This more than this! If you guys have been watching my videos for a really long time, you probably know that I have an extreme fear of like piercing my ears and ear piercings and piercings in general like they freak me out but I've always wanted stretched ears so I bought these magnetic ear stretcher tapers and they look like you're stretching your ears but you're not they're just magnetic and surprisingly they don't hurt that much and they're really cool if I could actually what the heck okay they're actually like really cool I'm obsessed with them um but don't wear them for long periods of time or else your ears have an indent on them and then it does hurt afterwards but just for like pictures like I got them for it's like really cool you guys have seen this in a lot of my recent videos I got this phone case this was also like two or three dollars I believe it's like a rose gold complete casing for your iPhone like for the front and the back it is the sturdiest phone case ever and I absolutely love it it collects fingerprints a lot but you can also use it as a mirror <laughs> I'm obsessed. The next thing I saw, and I thought it was so freaking cool, it is this bracelet, and it looks like a nail that's like bent and wrapped around your wrist. It is also rose gold, but then I saw in Kylie Jenner's snapshot that she has this, but like a diamond <laughs> encrusted one. Um, hers is probably the, I found out that like this is a knockoff of a real bracelet that costs like a lot of money, but I bought the fake one without knowing that. I just thought it was some cool street fashion thing. I'm obsessed with it and I pair it with my rose gold Michael Kors watch and it looks so good, I'm obsessed. Also along the lines of rose gold stuff, I got this necklace. I actually got the necklace piece and the chain separately. I believe the chain was like 75 cents and then this actual necklace part was, was like a dollar something. This is supposed to be a crystal but it's just a hunk of plastic and it was supposed to be a rose gold um, like crystal encasing but it is regular gold so it does not go with my rose gold chain that I got it, but I'm gonna order a new one. Hopefully this time it'll actually be crystal instead of being just stupid plastic. Or at least something that looks like a crystal. Next thing I got are some thigh high socks. These ones just have like stripey bits at the top and these are super cute, super comfy. They fit my feet perfectly. Usually with like socks like this, the heel part goes up onto my ankle and I'm like, okay, well obviously these don't fit. These fit me great and I love them and they were really cheap, but they took forever to get here. Four months. Now I have some makeup items, and the first ones are these eyelashes. I actually bought two whole containers of these because another YouTuber said that these are like amazing eyelashes, and I have to agree, they like are really cute. They're kind of hard to put on, but I'll get used to them because they're so cute. And yes, I, I absolutely love them. I'm wearing them today if I didn't already say that. And then I ordered this just because I thought it was so freaking weird. Have you ever heard of the Urban Decay Naked 4 palette? This is a fake version. Well, okay, it's not a fake version of the Urban Decay palette because this doesn't exist in real life. Like, the Urban Decay doesn't have a Naked 4 palette, but I guess that this wholesale company 
decided to make it and it's like really pretty I got it cuz I don't know I thought it would look like the Chi Chi spiced palette and um, the eyeshadows are not Urban Decay quality obviously because this is not Urban Decay they're like drugstore Maybelline Revlon quality so you know they still work good and it's a really big palette has a really big mirror really freaking weird though the Urban Decay naked for everyone so obviously it's not real I kind of want to order more like fake makeup online and do like a like review of them maybe so if you guys want to see that then thumbs up this video that is it for the ebay finds but the next thing i got is this bracelet that my mom bought me um from a bookstore and it's just like a really cute leather cuff and i really 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 like it so thank you mom and then the last things that i got are just some two items from romwe i'm going to be doing a lookbook with these but um i'm still waiting on a couple pieces for that lookbook so I thought I would just show you the items that I got. The first thing I got is this shirt and it is like a mustard camel colored striped crop top. It's not really that cropped. I thought it would be a little bit more cropped. It's kind of like a regular t-shirt on me <laughs> but it's super cute. I already have one kind of similar to it in black that I've done in a different lookbook which you can see by clicky clicking here. And then of course I cannot have enough high-waisted pants so I got this pair. Oh the crotch is open. Hey my. I got this pair hoping they'd be a little bit like the American Apparel Easy Jean I believe is what they're called but they kind of are not. It is just like this. They're extremely high-waisted and then they have rips in the knees. They are not the skinniest at the bottom. If you have very tiny ankles, they kind of flare out on my ankles. Um, but they're still skinny jeans. I just have to cuff them. But yes, I love them. Oh, yes, I forgot. I also got this headband from AliExpress. Actually, not eBay, AliExpress. And it was really cheap, like a dollar something. I always see all those beauty gurus with it. And I don't know if there's like a real version of it, not an AliExpress version. But it's so cute and I love it. <laughs> okay, anyway, this was your first time of my videos. Please remember to subscribe by clicking the subscribe button. If you actually like this video, please remember to like it by clicking the thumbs up. So thanks for watching and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye guys! Bye. Bye.